How's it going everybody? This is Charisma here and I just wanted to talk about a reflection moment. Um, you might be wondering like what is a reflection moment? Um, a reflection moment is when you uh, examine yourself, examine your motives as why you're doing certain things and this and that and just examining parts of your life. And I was having a reflection moment with my YouTube um with my YouTube and just like asking myself why am I doing like two niches for the thing for YouTube like why am I doing Roblox why am I doing commentary and I was just you know praying to God about it and just really wanted to just reflect on it and I really feel like I'm I want to do two niches right now because I'm afraid to do just one niche such as like Roblox um I feel like if I do two niches, I have like more stability in case one of them fails. And just really reflecting back on myself that like I'm just scared to fail. That uh, you know, I just after doing praying and such, I really feel like I should primarily do Roblox content, and then in the future, when the opportunity comes where I have a bigger fan base and this and that, I can do other content. But I, I, I just, uh, part of me feels like that I'm just scared to fail, that if I just stick to one niche and only do that one niche. And I feel like I should mostly do Roblox content and then like also like reaction content, um, like Skibby Twit and such. I think those are, um, you know, connected enough to Roblox where people do both, but news content and such like that. Just like random news content, I probably won't be doing that much anymore. And if it's like YouTube uh, content, like YouTube news, maybe I'll do a video here and there. But I think primarily I should make my channel focus on Roblox. And, uh, and for a couple reasons. One, I think it's been the most successful on my channel. It's the one that's going to get me... Um, from a business perspective, if you want to grow your YouTube channel, it's better to just stick to one niche at first and just grow on that. And, you know, I want to do YouTube full time and make that where that's where I make my money and not other jobs and such. So, in order to get there, I need to stick to one niche primarily. Um, and so I'm going to probably do Roblox content and I'll add in like reaction stuff, this and that. It'll either be Roblox related or like maybe gaming related or something. But mostly Roblox. And I also want to do this because I feel like I should. Like I, I feel like I feel like my channel is going to grow significantly more if I just stick to one Roblox. Or just stick to one niche primarily being Roblox. But I'm not gonna lie. I think it, part of me is scared to only stick to one niche primarily because I'm afraid that you know if it doesn't work out, then I then I fail, and um, I don't want to. I don't want to fail. I mean, who wants to fail? But and I'm also making this video because I just want to encourage other people out there that are like maybe you're at a crossroads and you have like two options, and one can be the safer option. One could be the scarier option, but you know that you should do that option. But maybe you just want to play it safe and never try the scarier option that you believe that's the one that's for you. And I just want to give encouragement that, like, it might be scary in that moment to pick the scarier option, but you know that's the option that you should do. Just go out on a limb and have faith. And that's what I'm going to do here at this channel is mostly do Roblox content and have faith that my Roblox content is going to take off and I'll eventually build a nice fan base around that and then in the future if I want to do vlogs and this and that it would make more a lot more sense then but for business sake for going out on faith's sake and just trusting God I'm just going to stick to primarily Roblox content most of it's going to be focused around Roblox and then I'll probably try to add in um, a little bit of reaction stuff that's that it can be at least somewhat close to Roblox to where both of my audience can bounce off each, off each other like Skibbity Toilet. I know a lot of people that watch Skibbity Toilet, they probably watch Roblox because I mean, you have like Creek Craft who's a big Roblox YouTuber who 
watches a lot of the Skibbity Toilet and I'm sh sure a lot of his audience too. So I'm going to try to just be a little bit more precise with stuff outside of Roblox, but mostly Roblox. So you probably won't see like two videos a day, one being Roblox and one being like some random news. If anything, going forward, it'll be one Roblox, Roblox video and then maybe some kind of reaction content that can be somewhat... Uh, somewhat close to Roblox or Gaming Spear or something like that. So, but I want to just encourage anyone that's scared of making a decision in their life that they know that they should, but it seems like the scarier option for whatever reason may be in your life. Maybe you crossroads in life where like, I don't know, you're in college and your parents want you to be a certain major, but you really feel like, you really feel deep down that you should pick a different major the one that you just you just firmly believe that you should be that major but you're scared of because of what your parents might think and this and that and I would just encourage you like just so, something like that just give an example just go with the one that you just firmly have faith in that might seem scarier and just take that chance worst comes to worst if you fail at least you can say I at least had the faith to try it and then you can try something else so that's what I'm going to be doing with Roblox and uh, I just want to say I appreciate you all and just got to have faith that the Roblox content will take off. And so, you guys have a good one. I appreciate you all. You guys are awesome. And thank you to the ones that just watch my content and support me along the way. It's, uh, if you ever wonder if I ever get discouraged or scared or whatever it may be when it comes to YouTube and this and that, it, yeah, it's a battle. But I keep pushing through it and... It, it motivates me to have people that watch my content on a daily basis, really, you know. So, you guys have a good one. I appreciate you all, and I will be coming out with some Roblox content.